Hi everyone, welcome to Eagle Eye Opener. I am Hosanna David. Welcome to 2020. It is our prayer that the Lord that has kept us to see this beautiful year will continue to keep us alive. I want to share with us a rapture vision that I had on the 27th of December 2019. That evening was so awesome. I had about uh, six visions that same day. It had six or five visions that same evening while I was lying on my bed. And the first one I had was that I saw a Christian club. The club was, uh, it wasn't a place where people were actually doing bad things. It was a Christian club. I never saw the owner. But what I noticed was that the club was sealed. It was soundproofed that those inside are totally cut off from whatsoever thing that is happening outside. They, there's no way they can hear what is happening outside the club. It was just sealed. It was uh, the dogs were shot and it was secluded. And as I watched, I then discovered that outside the rapture just took place, but those inside had no clue of what actually happened outside. And the Lord gave me the interpretation when I asked the Lord, what is the meaning of this vision? The Lord told me that the club I saw, the Christian club, is the church of today. When I mean, when I say the church, I don't mean the, any denomination in particular, but I'm talking about the body of Christ worldwide. That it is the church of today, that many of them are cut off from him, that many Christians are cut off from him, many congregations are cut off from him, that they don't even know when he's going to return. A lot of people have been carried away, just as I saw that the, those inside had nothing, uh, had no clue of what is happening outside. That is how a lot of people and a lot of men of God are cut off from the plans of God. You know, the Bible says, Jesus Christ said that we should watch because the Son of Man is going to return like a thief in the night and that no one knows the hour or the moment that he is going to return, that we should watch at all times so that he will not meet us sleeping. But if we can be sincere to ourselves, we will know that many people and many of our congregations are like the Laodicean Church. We have just only a few Christians and a few congregations that are actually heavily focused. And also the Lord told me that the way I saw that the rapture happened, that is how it is going to happen. And many people will be taken on our way. I want to tell us that um, whatsoever thing that we are doing that keeps us uh, in unwatchfulness, we have to leave it. And right there in, as I had a vision, uh, let me read what the Lord said. The, then the Spirit of the Lord was speaking to me, saying, Everything now should be pointing everyone to the rapture. He said this because there is urgent need to create awareness about the return of Jesus Christ. Immediately, I saw that the rapture took place and even those inside did not rapture. I heard the voice of the Lord say that everything now should be pointing people to the rapture. A lot of uh, times when we go to church, our attention are diverted from preparation from the Lord for the Lord that is returning very soon to uh, having living your best life now, having the good things of this world, miracles and prosperity. I'm not saying that we should talk about these things, but they are not the primary focus of the church right now. Primary focus is how, is how we can be ready for the return of the Lord because as we can see, everything is ready. Satan is ready. The system of this world is ready. But the church is not ready. Jesus Christ is ready to return back again. 
but many of us are not even ready. The Lord also told me concerning this vision that I had that many of today's church are just like a club, like a Christian club, and not actually a place that is preparing people for heaven. Just like the Christian club I saw is like a club, and that also there is a lot of bewitchment in church today, that people are being brainwashed with lies that they no longer listen to any other person, they no longer listen to the truth, because they have believed falsehood rather than believing the truth. Uh, today you see uh, some churches uh, where members are being fed with snakes, with cockroaches, with rats and different kinds of things, even grazing outside like animals. And they have refused to believe the truth that there is no Holy Spirit that will make people to behave like that. I don't know if you have accepted the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior, whether you're watching or you are asleep. Please, let's wake up. If you are asleep, wake up because the Lord Jesus Christ is going to return again. I don't know how much effort you are going to put into your life this year, but I know that it is not going to take long. It's not going to be long and the Lord Jesus Christ will return. A lot of people are saying that uh, Matthew chapter 24 says that immediately after the tribulation, uh, that the rapture will happen. No, it is not immediately after the tribulation. Immediately after the tribulation, the second advent will come. There is difference between the second advent, that is the second coming of Jesus Christ, and the rapture. The rapture is when Jesus Christ comes in the air, and those who are worthy, whose garments are white, will be caught up to meet the Lord in the air. That is not the second coming, and that event is what we are waiting for right now. Immediately that happens, the Antichrist is going to be officially released, and the persecution against Christians is going to begin officially. Uh, I had a vision, and the Lord was telling me some time ago, a few weeks ago, that He will not bring all these troubles. He will not allow his saints to experience all these troubles. That he must take his people home first. Those who are rapture, who are rapture ready, are going to be caught up before all these things are going to happen. Please repent. The two witnesses will not come. The Antichrist will not be officially released. The the tribulation, the great tribulation, is not going to begin until the rapture takes place. Thank you for watching. Visit our website, eagleeyeopener.com and biblicalsexualpurity.com. Do us a favor, share this video. And in any way you can support us in this ministry, even just sharing this video on WhatsApp, sharing the link on Facebook, on YouTube, we all know copyright to our, all our videos. We just share them. You can share them and repost them the way you want, so long as it is for the propagation of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Thank you. Have a good day. God bless you. Happy New Year once again. Bye-bye.